I'm here with Prasanna Balaprakash. He is a computer scientist at Argonne National Lab. Thank you so much for joining me this morning. Uh, first off, you do a lot of work in AI, so I want to dive into that a little bit. Uh, why is it so crucial in the world of automotive engineering? Um, I think artificial intelligence uh, is going to play a major role. Mm -hmm. um, I think um, starting from data perspective, so the amount of data that is going to be collected not only at the at the vehicle level, at the automobile level, but also at the atomic level where you will have to sort of study and understand um, uh, things at the atomic level to manufacture new materials. Um, you know, the amount of data collected at that level. How you go all the way up um, at the intercity level, at the intracity level, the amount of data being collected is so huge that you need automated solutions to process those data, okay? And um, the complexity involved Mm -hmm. um, let's say how these um, vehicles, automobiles, interact with each other, or how they are going to interact with the infrastructure provided by the city. And how are you involved in autonomous cars? Because certainly AI plays into that. Yeah. Um, we assume that industry will solve autonomous car problem, but we are asking some big questions. Mm. When the autonomous cars are on the road, then how they are going to interact with each other. Okay, so that that is are how um, the, the, the autonomous car are going to interact with the infrastructure, the city infrastructure. Right. We are doing big simulations. We are doing big simulations on some of the largest supercomputers on the planet and try to understand what these all are going to sort of affect uh, the city infrastructure, or traffic, and, and how we humans are going to interact with these autonomous cars. So, so these are the, 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 the different aspects of, uh, of our work. Yes. And we are also bringing in uh, you know some of um, the, uh, the the supercomputing capabilities and also the applied math capabilities uh, in addition to the AI to the transportation research. Wow, very complicated and very big questions that you're asking. Uh, I admire your work, definitely. It's super important. Thank you. Uh, let's talk about SAE and how it's actually helping you with your work. How is it helping you accomplish the things that you want to accomplish? Oh, so just um, from the domain perspective, you know, um, automotive engineering process. Uh, completely new set of challenges. You know, I'm a computer scientist, and the kind of challenges from the artificial intelligence research is is, is totally different from automotive engineering. So I'm trying to understand uh, what are the new constraints, what are the new problems posed by uh, by automotive engineering, right. and um, SAE is a, is a fantastic uh, um, venue for that. And I'm I'm talking to many people and trying to understand uh, uh, how AI needs to adapt. Right. Uh, for automobile engineering. Well, best of luck with it all. Thank all you right. for stopping by, Prasanna. Thank you so much.